obviously, uh, as a player, you just want to see yourself in the field, in the, in the field uh, and helping the team. But uh, at the same time, you need to understand the situation that you are at. And at the moment, I'm understanding the situation and then trying to respect the court's decision as well. Mishishi, there's a, a love that your teammates have for you. It's, it's, it's crazy because they have songs for you. Yeah. You know, you know, uh, it makes me happy. You know, for the fact that uh, from day one I started playing football, I just wanted to be a good example to the youngsters. And I'm happy when the, the youngsters, when they see me, they feel free. They are comfortable to, to come to me and talk to me, and uh, for whatever reason that they they want to improve or whatever. But uh, I'm very happy that uh, we have that bond with the guys and the brotherhood. Um, you have sent us playing six competitions, if my memory serves me well this season. I mean, you, you guys have got a very good squad that I've watched play uh, even yesterday. Uh, but is it something that uh, you guys sit and say, at least if we can win three, or is it a matter of one game of at a time, as well, football people always say? Yeah, obviously we know that it's all about one game at a time, but uh, us as guys, when we are sitting in the changing room, uh, we know our goals. We just want to win all the trophies that we're competing for because we, we have enough players, we have enough quality that we can do it. So why not? We just have to put uh, more effort. We know that is not going to be easy. But uh, if we can put more effort, then uh, the quality is there. How are you also managing yourself? I mean, you like Lorenzo has asked, I mean, you're an experienced campaigner. Yeah. You know, is there anything you do differently to sort of manage the workload? To be honest, there's no secret. Uh, the only thing that I do, I, I, I work hard. I do recovery very well and uh, try to do extras. It's very important to do extras. And I watch my games and I become honest to myself and say, you know what, uh, this season I didn't score much. I have to go into shooting and try to improve uh, the numbers of goals, try to improve the numbers of uh, assists, uh, try to get better as a player each and every season. You've been the love still the same as when you were a young man coming up uh, at Sundowns, going on road, coming back now. Like, but how is it at 34? Is it, yeah, for me, the for me, it's still there. It's still there. As I said before, that I, I just want to be a good example to the youngsters. So that's what keeps me going. That's what keeps me hungry for the game. I just want to finish on the high note. I don't know when I'm going to finish my career, but uh, as long as I'm still getting the chance, I just want to use the chance and try to win more trophies. Shishi, we've seen you invest in your body quite a lot. By turning to your home, you have a gym at home. We see that you do quite a lot of work. How important is that to sustaining you long term, to sustaining your longevity in the game? Yeah, it's very important as a player to, to, to keep going and try to have a, a, a personal trainer, a Pravus. He's been helping me so much. Uh, he's the guy that uh, always pushes me, the guy that uh, will offer me the, the, the massage and try to get me ready for, for the matches, knowing for sure that we don't have uh, easy matches at some times. Just one. Um, I was speaking to Flombo just before you came here now. Yeah. He said that you're quiet on the pitch, you don't talk, you don't go for the ball. And like there was a player specifically, Jeremy Brocky, who got frustrated and he didn't know where you're going, what you're doing. Yeah. But now you've got the influx of these South Americans who you can't really communicate with. Yeah. Is it like a different game with your mediators, <laughs> Raperos, your Alendis now? Uh, what I can say is that we communicate uh, through football language. I mean, they started training. They can see uh, the way I, I, I want the ball. I just move. That's why you check in, in the game. I don't do a lot of movement. I just maybe move two step, three step. They already know that, okay, he's on the right or he's on the left. So it's, it's all about the uh, football communication.